Hey guys, it's your boy Frosty Gorilla here. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to add a keyboard overlay into OBS. Now go down in the description, click the link, or copy it and paste it into your browser. Go there, wait for the timer to count down as you see right there. As soon as it counts down to zero, it'll bring you a download right here. Now it's going to be a zip file. All you got to do is click it, go over to Extract All. Now as soon as you click that, be sure to hit Extract again. It's going to pop up in another window click this scroll all the way down until you see the icon double click that and it's gonna bring up the keyboard in your window okay so now we're at the fun part you can see you can clickety clack all day long and then letters and numbers will highlight for you now what you're gonna want to do is close all the windows go over into your OBS and add a source you're gonna go all the way down to window capture now if it doesn't automatically bring it up once you click OK just click right there where my mouse is and scroll down to where it says no board or however you pronounce it. Now it's gonna pop up into your OBS system right here. You can adjust it however you like. Make sure you go over to filters, click add filter, and then go to chroma key. Now once you go to chroma key, click OK. That's gonna pop up in a window. Go over to key color type, change it to the background which is blue, and then go down to similarity and adjust that towards the left to your liking. What we're basically trying to do is get rid of the entire background except for the actual keys itself. Now once you get all these settings set up, go ahead and hit close. And now to the actual settings of the software itself, right click and go into settings. And now you're going to have a whole bunch of different options you can choose from to be able to change this keyboard around. You can even change the keyboard where it says games. I don't really like this area because it's not really made for the modern gamer. It's literally just arrow keys. Now they do have a mouse option, which is kind of weird, but I mean, I can see a lot of streamers possibly using this kind of software like this. What I would do if I was going to be using it is open this software into two different windows. That way you can have your keyboard and your mouse going on at the same time. But me personally, I feel like it's going to be something that I'm going to have to explain every single time a new person joins a stream, so I'm not going to deal with it. Now every now and then, whenever you close the settings area, the keyboard will actually switch to another country or another form of a keyboard. All you got to do is click here scroll all the way down to where it says us dash whatever and it should bring you back to the form that you're wanting yourself now again this is a completely free software and it gives you so many different features that you're actually able to change for example the keyboard colors like the key keys itself all you got to do is go within this area change the colors up to your liking i prefer the black keys mixed with the white color font and then whenever you press the keys itself they all turn red Love it. Feel like it's a nice, clean outlook. Just make sure you don't pick any of the blue colors since that's the color you're actually trying to use within the chroma key area to make transparent. All right, there you go. That's it. Be sure to drop a like and a subscribe with notifications on. And stay frosty, my friends.